What's going on, Team Fresh? Welcome back to a new LSPDFR episode. Today, we're going to be doing a brand new hypercar patrol with a vehicle. We kind of used it before. This is a W Motors hypercar. And this thing looks especially amazing because it has all kinds of lights. Let's go ahead and do a quick walk around. First of all, we have a couple of lights in the windshield. We do have this lighting in the by the front lip over there, the, the red accent lighting, which looks absolutely Absolutely amazing also extends to the side skirts as well and we do have side runners on this vehicle so we do have wigwags and let me just go ahead and work my way towards the back I love the red accent lighting uh, with the uh, the side runners just looks absolutely amazing and not to mention delivery guys delivery looks great with blue lives matter themed uh, police logo over here. Uh, let's go ahead and uh, work our way towards the back We have a couple of lights in the back window there, and I think that's pretty much it But the vehicle is awesome. It sounds amazing as well. Let's go ahead and get inside. Here we go guys Listen into this exhaust note Sounds absolutely amazing. Even the police officers are impressed but anyway, let's go ahead and tell Dispatch that we're available for calls and we're going to begin today's patrol. Uh, for today, we obviously will want to do a top speed run by the end of today's episode. So make sure to leave your guesses in the comment section down below. I think this vehicle will top out around 179 miles per hour. Whoa! Whoa! Well, this is going to be my first... Hold on. Abuse of 911? All right, let's take that. Respond Fine. Code two. Fine. Code two. All right, we'll do that. All right, I was gonna pull over that lady. She was driving like crazy, but at least she didn't hit me. That it could have been worse than it really was. All right, so let me go ahead and respond code two. You guys will see the lights are on. Dude, stop! Are you kidding me right now? Wow. We have more lighting in the front. I don't know how people don't see that. It's just kind of crazy, man. Lighting in the back, I, I, I can tell. It's a little bit like I wish that we had more lights in the back, but side runners are crazy and the lights in the front, that's plenty. All right, anyway, we are pulling up, I think. Well, never mind. It's like a mile away. Hold on. I thought it was going to be a lot closer. Let me go ahead and just go code three. Whoa! Come on, man. Oh my gosh. Literally sideswipe that guy. All right. Go this way. Go this way. Is it gonna be over here at one of the uh, the corporate park? I think it's like a corporate park over here. All right. In this case, I can turn off the lights. Go through the speed bump, and here we go, guys. Yeah, it's about half a mile away. Let me go ahead and step on it and see who's abusing 911 over here. It's a corporate park, so somebody's at work. Dialing 911 and abusing our service? That's not gonna happen. Not today. Alright, here we go, guys. I think we're pulling up and it's gonna be over here. There's another parking lot. Perfect. Alright. I'm on location. There's a suspicious guy over here. Do we just park our vehicle? There's another guy right here. I'm just gonna park here, right here. Alright. So what's going on? <laughs> Do I just look for someone? Oh, here we go. Hello, we have reports of 911 calls. Well, I phoned 911 recently, but wasn't right then. I need to search your phone. Go for it. I ain't got nothing to hide. Okay, search the suspect's phone for any history. Okay. All right. Let's go ahead and search this guy. A phone containing several recent 911 calls. So he definitely lied to me. This guy. You're going to be going to jail today. I'm Police, sorry, dude. Hands up now! Alright. Well, let's place him in custody. Shouldn't be dialing 911. Obviously, he was telling me there was nothing. Like, he wasn't calling 911. But after I searched him, he gave me consent. He gave me consent to search him. Uh, we found that he did indeed dial 911 several times. Oh, you wish you could go for a ride in this hypercar, don't you? That is not gonna happen. 
Um, let me get a unit out here. Do we actually pat him down and see if he's got any other uh, items besides the cell phone? Let's go ahead and uh, search him really quickly. I think we have a unit coming up right there. All right. Let's see. Oh, that's it. That's all we found. <laughs> all right. It looks like we got another unit pulling up right there. See, I'm not the only one sideswiping vehicles in this game. AI drivers do that too. All right, man. And on this note, let's get out of here and see if we can get any other calls today. There's something wrong with the wheels. You guys see? It looks like they're bouncing around. I don't know. I mean, the vehicle is not bouncing anywhere. But the wheels... I don't know, man. Just got a call for a pursuit in progress. Uh, catch up to the pursuit. Let's go ahead and do that. It's actually over here. What is happening over here? Oh, is that the guy? What's up, buddy? <laughs> All right, don't move. Don't move. That, I think that must have been the driver. On the ground. And I think we got the other person, too. Something's going on at this uh, corporate park. A bunch of crazies working here or something. I think we have that officer chasing the other suspect. All right, somebody pick up this guy. All right, let me go ahead and try and assist her. I'm actually going to go off-road in this vehicle. Oh, my gosh. Hold on. This guy also has my vehicle. Are you kidding me? Oh, never mind. She arrested him. <laughs> I just ran over something. All right, good job, officer. Good job. You're just going to leave him here? All right. Look at the way the doors open, too. So awesome. All right. You have anything illegal, dude? Nice uh, cardigan with the jeans. I like that. All right. Let me get a unit out here. All right. Someone's coming to pick him up. Don't you go anywhere, okay, dude? All right. Let's get out of here. Man. I thought the doors opened in a different way on this vehicle. They were supposed to be like suicide doors, but maybe I'm wrong. Hmm. Uh, and uh, yeah, that the reason why they're called suicide is because they would open in a different way, like literally backwards from the way the normal doors open. But this is like a Lambo door. I don't know, man. Whatever. Let's get out of here, dude. You can even see the w the wheels bouncing everywhere. Just so weird. I don't know what's going on with the wheels. The vehicle itself is very stable and it doesn't shake at all. It's just the wheels. Something's up with them. <laughs> all right. Anyway, let's see if we can get any other calls today. What is going on with this dude right here? Just kind of driving back and forth. <laughs> Caught some air right there. Let me go ahead and run his uh, license plate really quickly. Let's see what comes back. This guy is a little plate. suspicious. Zero, Belongs Zebra, to Michelle Shero. No, no 1099, no citations, no flags. Okay, I think she's fine. I'm going to follow her for a little bit more. Make sure she doesn't do anything stupid. Oh my gosh, there's so many stupid drivers in the game. It looks like she's almost like willing to pass people. I don't know. She's like in a hurry or something. I'm going to stick right behind her for right now. I'm kind of curious. I, I think she's about to do something stupid and get pulled over. Maybe she doesn't recognize that we are a police vehicle behind her. Which is kind of tough to tell. Right? I don't know. What do you guys think? I think she's behaving now. I mean, she's a little too close to the vehicle, but since there's no flags on the vehicle and she's not doing anything extremely illegal, I think I'll just let her go. All units, we've got a 653 Mary on a suspicious vehicle in Pacific Bluff. All right, just got reports of a car bomb. Let's go ahead and respond code three to that one. It's a Penumbra is the vehicle we're going to be looking for. We got an anonymous caller who just reported the bomb to us. And it's going to be in the same lot that the vehicle just pulled into that we were uh, kind of following. All right. Looking for a Penumbra. 
Let's go ahead and see. Which one is it? Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and park, like, kind of far away. Actually, I'm gonna park right here. In case things go sour and things blow up. But let's go ahead and inspect the vehicle. I love doing this, by the way. This is so, so much fun. My success rate is not very good. 40-something seconds. I love using the, the hack tool. Oh, my gosh. I am not very good at this, guys. At all. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, my gosh. What an explosion! What happened with the whole parking lot? We failed to disarm the explosive. Well, that's obvious. There were so many cars here, and they're all gone. Absolutely gone. That's so crazy to me. What happened to my vehicle? I even parked it on the side. And my body was thrown into the building. By the way, I don't know how I'm still alive. Uh, half my health is gone. All of my armor is gone. That's the penumbra, by the way, that blew up. But how about my vehicle? Is it even on the map? Let's go ahead and take a look. Oh my gosh, it is. It's on the road. <laughs> Hold on. We got to see this. We got to see this. So the explosion was so powerful. My vehicle was right here. It flew across this whole lake over here. All the way on the other side. Oh my gosh. I don't want to even see what's left of my car. How many of you guys think that the car survived? Uh oh. Hold on. We got gunshots. Oh my gosh. I don't know, man. I think the car is destroyed, honestly. I think it's completely destroyed. It's got to be. Is that street racing in progress? Those guys were driving way too quick. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's take a look. I think I see something over here. Oh my goodness, dude. Hold on. It looks fine. I think it looks, well, I think it's got a few scratches and bumps on the car for sure. The front bumper is a little destroyed. The windows are gone. There's some scrapes. High speed pursuit. Oh my gosh. This vehicle is completely destroyed. But here we are responding code 3. Let's go ahead and catch up to the suspect. Oh my gosh. I don't want to lose him. I don't want to lose him. Go this way. Go this way. They are definitely heading southbound. Let me go ahead and step on it. I think the suspect is right in front of us, actually. Oh, my gosh, dude. What are they driving? Go, go, go. Careful. Oh, my gosh, dude. Watch out for the pedestrians. Oh, my gosh. All right, this police officer is blocking my way. Oh, dude. Are you serious right now? Hold on. I'm going after the guy. Come on. Let me get through. Oh, my gosh. I'm totally stuck. The guy is running away. Hold on. All right, you just wanted to drive by? Wow, okay. That's great police work over here. Come on, dude. <laughs> did he escape? You've got to be kidding me. Or no, did we arrest him? This police officer is coming back. I have no idea what just happened. Did he run away? Did we get him? Watch out for the puppy. Puppy, careful. <laughs> Oh my gosh, there's someone else too on the mini-map. All right, let's go after that person. Maybe that's another pursuit that's happening over there. There's a helicopter. I'm going to go code three. We'll try and catch up to the suspect. And it's over by the beach area. I do see the helicopter over there. I think so, man. This is going to be exciting. Let's get all the way to towards the end of the road here. We are on Bay City Avenue, and I think the suspect is over there by the parking lot, by the beach. It's coming our way, right? Oh, my gosh. He's doing, like, donuts in the sand. All right. Here, here he is. Woo! Driver! Stop. Stop the vehicle right there. Um, let me go. Ahead. Oh, my gosh, man. I have all the weapons in the world now. All right. Stop running. Get on the ground. You're done. You're done. All right, at least we'll get her. Because she's definitely running. We have the helicopter chasing her. Whew. Man, two helicopters. Like, almost three. I don't know what that one is. Maybe news? 
Yeah. I don't know. Some kind of news uh, coverage or something. Yeah. Either that or it could be like a uh, lifeguard. I don't know. Um, either way, go ahead and sit down for me, lady. You have anything illegal on you? Let's go ahead and search her really quickly. Um, dude, you want to pick her up and take her to jail? Yeah? I think he might. Alright, there you go. Alright, thanks, officer. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to search her vehicle, call for a tow truck. This is a nice one, too. Z-Type. It's very expensive. Can't believe she was running from us in this. Don't want to mess it up. Um, see you, officer. Where are you? There he is. <laughs> All right. Let me go ahead and call for a tow truck, and we should be good to go here. Um, well, I'll, the next thing I want to do now is I want to test out the top speed of our vehicle, guys. I know a lot of you guys have been waiting for this moment. Here we go. All right. Let's get out of here. Once again, my guess is 179 miles per hour. Did I just ram him? I think so. <laughs> 179 is going to be my guess. Let's go ahead and fix it up, and we'll test out the top speed. Let's go. All right, guys. And here we go. Man, this vehicle is nice and brand new again, but look at those wheels. Something is really wrong with them. The way they're just like bouncing up and down is just a little odd. But here we go, guys. We're doing over 186, 191 blink. Is that going to be the top speed? One, oh, 201. 201 miles per hour is going to be the top speed of this vehicle. If you guys guessed it, great job. But on this note, I'm going to end today's episode. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to smash that like button. As always, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.